in this week's portion in Vayetze, when Yaakov goes to sleep and he has a dream and he sees that the angels are ascending and descending, Olin Vyardenboy, Vihini Hashem Nitzalavalov, and then he sees that Hashem is present. The deeper experience of Jacob is that he comes to the realization that it's not about the Olim, about the high, and it's not about the Yardim, which is the low. He encounters the essence of Makom, the essence of space, the essence of consciousness, the essence of time, the essence of himself, not in the high and not in the low, in the moments where it's not high and it's not low. That's a very deep experience of encounter. And this is also reflected in terms of our breath. In breathing, we have an inhale and an exhale. Every time we exhale, we're expiring, meaning we're, we're reaching towards our source, towards the Creator. Every minor exhale that we experience throughout life is a reflection of the ultimate exhale, when, which is death, where we just expire into the light. Every time we take an inhale, we're breathing in oxygen and we're filling ourselves. So every moment there's an exhale, there's a death of sort, and every time we're taking an inhale, there's a reliving, a rebirthing of sort. And this is the process of movement. Like the rhythm of life, like the rhythm of time, which moves past, present, future, space, consciousness, everything has a movement, a rhythm. The same thing also, there's a rhythm within ourselves, which is the inhale and the exhale. But then there's a point that exists in the in-between moments between the inhale and the exhale. Every time you take an inhale, before you take an exhale, there's a small moment of retention. That's where you're not inhaling, you're not exhaling. Every time you take an exhale, before you inhale, there's a retention period. That still moment where you're not emptying yourself in the exhale, you're not filling yourself in the inhale, is that moment where we can have the deepest experiences of self and of the divine. Because when we're having an up experience, an oilim experience, when we're exhaling, we're moving, we're transcending, we're feeling really close, there's the ego involved. When we're having a yardim experience, a descend experience, we're stuck in our smaller e little ego and we're, we feel the, the pain of life and the drama of life, we're still stuck in our ego. So we cannot have a real full encounter. The only place that we can have a true encounter with self, if we really want to know who we are, and who, who we are, Noichich Pnei Hashem, in front of Hashem at every moment, it's not in the high, and it's not in the low, it's not in the exhale, it's not in the inhale. It's in that retention period that exists between the inhale and the exhale. So simply this means if you're, if you're breathing, just be conscious of your breath, say, I'm exhaling, I'm emptying myself, I'm inhaling, I'm filling myself. But then there's the moment, the small moments that exist right in between. I'm not inhaling, I'm not exhaling, and that's where I can really find myself.